Hello my dear watchers and welcome back to our YouTube channel. If you want to create a password protected quiz on WordPress for free in counted minutes, then watch this video and follow the mentioned steps. The free version of the QuizMaker plugin gives the opportunity to create one general password for all the users to pass the quiz. So you can go to the WordPress and click on a download button to download and install the QuizMaker plugin. The first step to create a quiz is to go to the questions page and create a new question by clicking on the add new button as I have already created my quiz with questions we go back to the quizzes page and click on the particular quiz in our case it is password protected quiz by scrolling down a little bit we will see the questions added to our quiz at first let us discuss what we can achieve with the free version of the plugin we go to the limitation users tab and scroll down a little bit to see the password for passing quiz option we tick it uh, here is the general sub option of the password for passing quiz option this sub option is available in a free version of the plugin so we can set one general password that will work for all users of the quiz for example we can write one two three and four then comes the password input width option with the help of which we can uh, define the size of the password text box for example we can set it uh, 100 uh, or we can leave it blank for 100 percent the next option is enable toggle password visibility option with the help of which you can decide whether to display or not the password visibility on the front end the last one is the message sub option uh, which shows the text uh, before filling in the password on the front end for example we can fill in please fill the password and uh, this text will be displayed on the front end for the users before filling in the password in my case particularly i have already uh, tick the create post for quiz option saved uh, the quiz and my uh, post with the quiz is already generated so we can see the view post option here uh, by clicking on a view post option our quiz is uh, already displayed on a front end uh, or we can just uh, copy the shortcut of the plugin and um, create a new post with it so we go to the post page uh, click on the add new button um, name our post uh, let it be password protected quiz password protected quiz and we paste the shortcut of the plugin here then click on the publish button and view post button here is our quiz so uh, we have set a password for it one two three four so uh, we fill it here one two three four and click on a start button to pass our quiz here we fill in the name and email uh, fields as they are required and click on the next button to pass our quiz so we pass it and see the result Together, we have created a password protected quiz with a free version of the plugin uh, with one general password for all the users. But please note that with the pro version of the plugin, you can set uh, a password for each user. That means the password will be of single usage. So uh, please let me show you how to achieve this. We go to our quiz, limitation users tab and here we need to tick the generated password checkbox. As you can see we can mention how many passwords we would like to generate. For example we can generate 20 passwords. So we uh, fill in a 20 value and click on a submit button. As you can see 20 passwords are 
generated automatically for our quiz so that means uh, it is single usage password for each user if we want to make the password active for the quiz we just click here as you can see the password is transferred to the active fields that means this is the password for this quiz for this time if we fill in this password for the quiz one time, the password will appear in a used field. That means we can't use this password again. We are done with setting our generated passwords. Uh, so we can save the changes and see the quiz on a front end. So we go to our quiz directly and reload it. Here we can see our quiz where we need to fill the password. We go back to our quiz and copy the password, then fill it here and click on the start button. As you can see, it is right. However, when we refresh the page uh, and go back to our quiz and refresh it as well, uh, we will see that the password has changed and uh, the generated password has appeared uh, in the used field. That means uh, currently the quiz doesn't have any active passwords. But if we click here and generate an active password, save the changes, then uh, copy the active password and go back to our quiz. We will see that it asks for password again, so we fill it here and click on the start button to pass our quiz. Again, if we refresh the page here, then go back to our quiz and refresh it as well. We will see that the password, the active one, has appeared in a used field and there, there is no active password for the quiz again. Today together, we have created a password protected quiz for your website. Stay up for more informative videos. Bye!